Hey y'all, welcome to Life on Goldman Road. Tonight for supper, Clarence is going to be grilling, and that is a good thing. I have been a little under the weather, the reason for no video on Friday, but I'm feeling better. Uh, sinus, what can I say? Everybody's got it. It's just the crud. But I am feeling a lot better. I did a lot today in the house, probably a lot more than I should have, to be honest. My, uh, stomach area is a little sore tonight. So, I am, it's almost six o'clock. I have got burgers padded out, and we also have a freezer meal. We are doing the lemon garlic chicken from our freezer meals. So, we're going to do that. That looks scrumptious. He's going to throw those on the grill. Also, we had a friend to go elk hunting. And he brought us elk. So we're going to do burgers from the elk tonight. They look so good. Now probably for the chicken, I am going to uh, chop it up and make it into like um, cubes for my salad next week. Because I want to try the elk. I'm excited about that. That is something new and different we have never tried. So, uh, Clarence is going to get that on the grill. And supper will be done. I'm probably <coughs> going to throw uh, some potatoes in the oven. Probably do some roasted fries. I will probably eat mine bunless. Because I'm having the french fries. But that's okay. Uh, then I'll get back on track with my... Grilled chicken salads for next week, which will be delicious. And I'm going to have to try a little bit of that chicken tonight because when I was making that up, it smelled so good. So, and lemon pepper chicken is one of my favorite flavors. Uh, so, we're going to have to try that. But anyway, just excuse everything going on behind me. <sighs> what I did today was crazy. So, I got in a, well, I swept the floor and I mopped. Yeah, um, and then I got into this Dustin craze, so I got down on the floor and wiped down the legs and spindles of my table and my chairs. Tip for anybody looking for a dining room table and chairs, go plain. Plain is the way to go. Plain. Four legs, nothing fancy. Um, I have spindles. I, I'll show you. Hold on. This is what I'm talking about. This is the, the end of my table. I have eight chairs. And my chairs, ha and excuse my table because it has a whole bunch of junk on it, but my chairs are like this. So everything, everything collects dust. And you know, when you have dogs, they have everything else going on. So... Got down there today and cleaned all that up. Did I do too much? Probably. Yeah, probably. I also dusted off the china cabinet. This is crap here on my table that's got to go. Got to go. Uh, we are getting ready for the holidays, so that, that has got to be cleared so I can have family and friends over and enjoy being together. Um, what else did I do today? Mm, the sweeping and mopping about put me out. But then when I got to doing these chairs, flipping them, getting the legs, wiping them down, that really did it. We had to run to Louisville tonight to get um, some auction items. We were in a live auction on Tuesday. And they left a couple of things out of our box, which that's fine. They were having an auction tonight, and I would have loved to have stayed because she had some really good stuff. But I knew we had this at home, and I'm about to starve. So, let's get that on the grill. I almost forgot to tell you about why they got our chickens early. So, and I am fluffing a little tree. Uh, but they picked up our chickens early because the company that we have a contract with didn't need the chickens. Um, our chickens have roosters with them, so our eggs are fertilized. 
So they go to the hatchery to be hatched out for little chicks that goes then to other farms. And then those farms then go to the grocery store and different fast food chains and things like that. So certain times of the year, they get like an overabundance. And it doesn't happen very often, but it did this year. And it um, was just kind of making chaos. They, they just they really didn't need the birds. So that's why they picked us up early. They picked us up 10 weeks early. So our, our chickens turned 55 weeks old the night they picked them up. Um, we are usually at 65 weeks old when we are picked up, but anyway, so 10 weeks early and we don't go back in until the end of January. So things will probably be a little tight around here, but that's okay. We're going to make it through. No big deal there. We'll, we'll be fine. We just may be eating out of the freezer a lot more than usual, which is okay too, because you know we need to <laughs> we need to get in that freezer. So, um, Clarence and Hillary are both. Um, what did I do? They're they're both deer hunting this afternoon. Hillary and Grayson went to her stand, and Clarence went to his, which are polar opposites of the farm. Which are that's perfect you just don't want them you know neck and neck so they were off deer hunting I decided I needed some Christmas lights in my life so here we are my nose is itching I got company coming must have um I gotta sneeze now maybe to go away anyway oh just wanted to let you know about that so You'll probably, uh, clean out may be a little different this year. You know, last year I took you along with clean out and we did a bunch, but I'm on lifting restriction. 10 pounds still, week four, but we're still on lifting restrictions. So, we don't think about it. You know, we think lifting, 10 pounds. But think about this, when you're um, pulling something, or you're just sliding something across the floor. That's still poundage. So, clean out may look a little different this year. We're going to we're going to probably do little things, little things, no, nothing big. Um but I'll take you along with us as we go. We're we're having repairs done right now. Um we had our guy come in we sold Thursday night. He was here Friday morning. And he's like, I'm ready to go to work. <laughs> and we we had no we had no supplies for him. So we had to run and do a supply run. Our, you know how our nest go in the air and it freaks me out every year. Well, we're redoing those cables. So this year I will feel better when they go up. Um we have had these cables on these nests for eight years and we have had several places to break already. Usually when they're going up about that much off the floor, but still, if they're gonna break there, they're gonna break nine feet, you know? So I, that always makes me nervous. So we are redoing cable from one end to the other. Uh, it will be all new cable. Uh, it lasts between eight to ten years. Um, we are on our ninth flock of birds, but in our eighth year, that's crazy that how, you know, you get birds back and and you, you gain a year of birds on, on, our, on our time. So, we're getting ready for all of that. But I'm going to finish fluffing my Christmas tree. Y'all can get back to these elk burgers and chicken that we're going to have tonight. Um, there you go. All right, y'all. Clarence has got our chicken off the grill. It is. It smells so good. We're going to try it. I got a little piece right here. Mmm. 
That is so good. That will be delicious tomorrow after church on my salad. Oh, so good. Now, he also has the elk burgers off of the grill. So I'm going to go ahead and fix me run one. And All right, y'all. Here is my deconstructed burger. I've got my burger patty, lettuce, tomatoes, some homemade pickles. I am going to add some french fries to this and probably a little mustard. So let's try it. All right, here we go. That is really good. Mmm. Okay. All right, my camera keeps cutting off. I don't know why I've got 33 seconds before it does it again, but that is delicious. I appreciate you hanging out. I appreciate you being with me. I love each and every one of you. Thank you so much. Be sure to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell if you would like to be notified of upcoming videos. Um, I think that's about it. So until next time, I'll see you later.